Give them a great big hand. Fantastic, fantastic. Well, good evening, everyone. And a great and a great big Merry Christmas. Uh, it is my pleasure to welcome all of you here tonight to the ceremonial Capitol Christmas tree lighting ceremony. My name is Matt Lohr. I have the great honor of serving as our Secretary of Agriculture and Forestry. And what a wonderful treat it is to have all of you gathered here tonight on this beautiful evening to commemorate this special occasion and just an awesome opportunity as we can officially kick off the Christmas season. So in the state of Virginia, our agriculture industry ranks number one and our forestry industry ranks number three. And my job as the secretary is every day to promote all of the Virginia grown and Virginia raised products all across the Commonwealth and across the country. And today is certainly no exception. Governor, I really do love my job that you've given me. Um, Christmas trees here in the state of Virginia, you may not know, are, are really big business. Virginia ranks seventh in the nation in Christmas tree production. We have over 10,000 acres across the Commonwealth, and it generates $11 million in sales every year of people that choose Virginia Christmas trees. So if you haven't gotten yours yet, uh, I certainly would encourage all of you to make sure that you go out and purchase a Virginia-grown Christmas tree this year and support our local forestry industry. I want to thank a few folks that were able to make this event happened here with our Christmas tree here, our, our Department of Forestry team. They were able to go out and scout and find the perfect tree. They, they cut it down. They hauled it here. And then the good folks at DGS did the rest of the work of getting it up. But we've got our leaders of our Department of Forestry here. I just want to recognize them. Rob Farrell is our state forester. He's waving his hand right here. Rob, uh, thank you. Ed Zimmer is our deputy forester over there as well. Uh, Terry Lasher, our assistant state forester as well. So thank you for recognizing these three for the great work they do leading our Department of Forestry. And certainly want to thank Roy and Betty Wilkins of Apple Valley Tree Farm in Frederick County. They're the ones that actually donated the tree. And although they're not here tonight, we certainly want to thank them again for making this great donation here to the Capitol. Uh, for me personally, from, from Rockingham County, I have visited the same tree farm for the last 25 years, taking my family out. Uh, the day after Thanksgiving to actually cut the tree down. It's been a, a, a tradition for us, one of our favorite times of the year. And there's nothing better than, than gathering the family out together and making those special memories, spending time with family, and, and officially kicking off the Christmas season. And so I sincerely hope that each of you 
that are gathered here tonight. Have a blessed holiday season, and we sincerely appreciate you coming out tonight for this very special ceremony. Um, one of the best parts of my job is having the opportunity to introduce the governor at these types of events. And the first lady, thank you so much for being here. Um, they're going to lead us in the official lighting of the tree in just a minute. But I want to give a special thanks to them for all that they do and certainly opening up the mansion tonight and allowing the citizens a chance to come in and view the beautiful decorations and the beautiful decor in the mansion and have a chance to get a, a picture taken by the tree. So thank you all for your hospitality and your generosity. Governor Yunkin is a tireless promoter of all things Virginia. I think we can all agree he's always looking to promote Virginia wherever he goes. And he's a true public servant, a compassionate leader, and a thoughtful decision maker. And I can tell you his decision to make Virginia the best state to live, work, and raise a family certainly pushes all of us in, in the cabinet and all of us on the team to be the best leaders that we can be every day. It's truly an honor to work for him, and it's a pleasure to have the chance to introduce him to the podium tonight. Would you join me in welcoming our 74th Governor of the Commonwealth, Governor Glenn Youngkin. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you. Well, good evening and Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Welcome to Capitol Square. How exciting it is to all be together, to in fact gather here and for those of you that are watching online, we know you're here in spirit. I, too, want to add my thanks to a number of people, but particularly to Eastern View High School Choir. Thank you so much. They came all the way from Culpeper to sing with us tonight. Uh, you will hear them throughout the evening, and so thank you. And I can't tell you what a blessing it is to have you with us. I also want to thank the Department of General Services. The staff did so much in order to get everything ready. Get everything ready when, yes, there's still a little construction going on around Capitol Square. And so thank you all for making sure that the Virginia Christmas tree is ready for tonight's festivities. And let me add once again to Secretary Lohr's appropriate appreciation to Roy and Betty Wilkins from Apple, Apple Valley Tree Farm. How many people have been to a tree farm? See, now we're talking. You go to a tree farm and you take a moment and pick that tree and you have an opportunity to envision that tree in your home. And when I look at this tree, I'm glad it's out here because it won't fit in anyone's home. What an extraordinary Christmas tree we have. As we have a minute to celebrate the season of giving, and the season of receiving, I hope we can all remember that the greatest gift that we can give to each other during this season is the gift of love. I'm particularly touched by the work that we just finished where we were able to support the Salvation Army's Angel Tree Program. And the staff here on the Capitol Square donated to this incredible cause. I hope that we can all find a way to help one another during this Christmas season to show support and love to all of those who may be celebrating alone or away from family or serving our great country overseas. And in light of the tragic events over the last few weeks, May we all remember the departed and open our hearts to express love for the families of the victims in Chesapeake and in Charlottesville. For many, Christmas is a time to share with family and friends in joy and good tidings and a time to reflect on the year that has finished that's behind us and to look forward to the next one. A time to pray for peace on earth and goodwill to all men. For our family, Christmas is a time to commemorate the nativity of our Lord. To celebrate when God's word became flesh and dwelt among us full of grace and truth. A day to lift up the truth spoken in Luke 2.11. For today in the city of David... There has been born for you a Savior, 
the Christ our Lord. Now before we light this tree, Suzanne and I want to invite everyone to the Executive Mansion Open House. It is the people's house and we are the temporary residents. But thank you for hiring us and letting us live there. It is such a privilege. This year's theme is a harvest holiday. The Executive Mansion is decorated with trees and wreaths donated by the by the Klaus family, who during this time of year we call the Claus family, and the Houston family. I'm so thankful for all that they do to bring the spirit of Christmas into everyone's home and their front doors across the Commonwealth. And so, First Lady, would you join me as we light the tree? Yes. Got it. A little instruction. So if we could all together, we're going to count down from five. And when we get to one, magically, the lights will come on. That's my cue to the team. That's what we're hoping. Are we ready? Four. Five, four, three, two, one. Merry Christmas. So on behalf of the entire Commonwealth of Virginia, I wish each and every one of you a blessed and Merry Christmas. And please come to the mansion. God bless you all. Thank you. Merry Christmas.